Another Code Wars challenge. Uh, this one's a level eight. We're doing it in JavaScript. Uh, and as always, there'll be a link to the challenge in the show notes if you want to try it out before watching the video. It's the best way to learn. Uh, another great way to learn is with repeated practice. Uh, so subscribe to the channel and you'll be updated every time I post a new video. Uh, so with that, let's get started. So we're gonna, a user's gonna fill out a form and we'll be given that form data and we have to clean out some characters and this prevents uh, from certain types of hacks uh, known as cross-site scripting. So anytime we get a left angle bracket in the string, we need to replace it with an LT. Uh, same thing for the right angle bracket. We have a greater than quote is and quote, and then ampersand is and amp. Um, so with that, let's uh, let's go ahead and set up our function here. So uh, what we're going to do is we're going to say we want form data dot replace, and so we're going to have to do a regular expression here. I try to avoid. Uh, doing regular expressions in Code War Solutions uh, just because uh, it's kind of its own separate skill that needs to be learned. And so I'm going to do a little bit of regular expressions here. Uh, so what we'll do is we'll we'll put that in a regular expression and we're going to do G for global. Um, newer browsers can do this. You can actually do replace all, uh, but it's not going to work here uh, in, in Code Wars. Um, so with that, uh, we're going to replace uh, all, the G there stands for global, so all uh, angle brackets, and we'll replace it with and uh, less than. Uh, and we need to set form data equal to this, okay? Oops, form, form data equal to that. So we need to do this uh, four times and then return that. Now, if this were gonna get any longer, uh, what I'd probably do is just set these up as an object. Um, but since uh, this is just a quick challenge, um, we'll just do we'll just do it like this, okay? Uh, so let's do a quote here, and we only want one quote. So watch that; it tried to autocomplete me there. Um, so we want end uh, quote. Now the interesting one is this ampersand, uh, because you'll notice that we've been throwing in ampersands in all of these. Uh, so my hunch is we probably need to do this one first. Um, so let's try that out. Just throw it at the beginning there. And then we'll return uh, form data here. Okay. So let's test this out. All right, looking good. Let's do a submission here. And I guarantee you there's going to be a better way to do this. So let's, uh, I kind of want to see what other folks did. Okay, they did. Uh, they just chained them all together. So uh, not too far uh, from what I was doing, but uh, you can do form data dot replace dot replace dot replace dot replace uh, and so same goal there oh my gosh look at this one Whew. Ugh. Um, so kind of a nicer way to clean that up I'd probably do that one in retrospect um, so great work y'all